Good morning. It's a beautiful sunny day today. And today I wanted to take some time to talk about words that when we make plural, we add an ES to the end of them. So normally for a word like dog, if we wanted to change that to dogs, meaning two, we would just add an S. But there are some words that end in SH, CH, X, S, and Z that you can't just add an S to. You have to ha add an ES to. For example, I see the B's over here. One B will buzz, but all of them together, um, when you say that more than one B, they, it's buzzes. So, also we have branches here. One is called a branch, but two are called branches. Right now, in our field, we have more than one grass that's growing. My husband plants the grass that turns into hay and he plants clover and he plants Timothy. So we have different types of grasses that feed our horses. We have certain areas of our grass that have a patch in them. More than one patch is called patches. Um, and then with the bees, if you get stung, it hurts, but after a while you have an itch and it itches and we would add an ES to that. Um, so there are lots of different ways to make a word plural. S, adding S at the end is usually the way, but unfortunately there are some exceptions to that rule as we all know. So sometimes we have to add ES to words to make them plural. See how many words you can come up with that you need to add ES to in order to make them plural today.